Today we had a chance to take a tour of the brand new jail here in Berkeley County to see how things are looking right now and what they're going to look like in the future. You got to financially be in a position to do something like this and, and years ago when there was a need the county wasn't in a very good position. Supervisor Johnny Cribb tells me they saved money for years to be able to build the new 42 million dollar jail without a tax increase. The groundbreaking happened last May. It's going to be a lot safer for our jailers so the computer technology would be able to open doors and lock down doors and things like that. It used to be very manual. It's now going to be like what you see in the movies sometimes where it's computer generated. The current jail holds 290 inmates, but it's been overcrowded for years. This new jail will hold 565. Cells of different sizes will keep dangerous inmates away from each other. Because of rival gang memberships before they ever arrived here, and we've got to keep everybody separate and safe. Once complete, this building will be four stories tall, taller than the current jail. This is going to be open mesh screens up above there, and this is where they'll come out and get their morning sun and conduct their exercise periods right in here. There will be an 11-bed medical facility in the new jail. The current jail has no medical facility. That means more minor medical issues can be handled on site. They're including large windows on cells, which make it easier to see in and keep an eye on inmates. There's actually going to be eight inmates contained in this area here. There's going to be a, a bunk there, a bunk there, a bunk there, a bunk there, and then around that corner here, four more bunks. They say inmates like being in group cells, so less dangerous inmates may get to live together. I mean, if there's eight guys in there spending their day watching TV and playing cards and rolling dice, then that's eight guys we don't have to worry about because they're happy and content. This construction process should be substantially completed by September of 2025. In Monk's Corner, I'm Raymond Owens. Count on two.